Hey guys, welcome back. So today we're doing a different kind of video that I'm so excited to film because I have been wanting to try out Forever 21 activewear for a while now and I just went on the site a few weeks ago like before I even left for Fiji and purchased so many things to test out for you guys. I wanted to get this up while I was in Fiji but I didn't have time to film it before we left so now is the time. I'm very excited. We have so much stuff to go through. So much that I actually took them all out of the plastic wrap and just decided to set them to the side so that I could go through them quickly, <laughs> hopefully. So let me know if you guys like this video idea. If you want me to continue to do more, then definitely give it a thumbs up. So it's kind of just like a first impressions activewear kind of clothing, which I'm very excited about because I love activewear. I live in activewear. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave and let's just go ahead and try on some affordable activewear. Testing, one, two, Three, testing. You look beautiful, test shot. Okay, so this is the first outfit. It's just a little burgundy outfit that I thought was really cute. It is the high-waisted one. All of the pants that I got are high-waisted, and for reference, if you wear Lululemon, I wear a size six in Lulu's. So, um, I got these in a medium. I think this detail right here, the like open mesh detail is super cute. Let's see if they're swap proof. They look to be squat proof, which is great. And I actually really like this shirt. Yeah, I really like this outfit. I think it's cute. I could have gone down a size um, in these leggings, I feel like, to a small, just because I have a lot of room in the crotch area. And it's just a little, it's just a little big. Also, I'm wearing this sports bra in this color. So it's really sexy. It has like a nice deep V. So that's what it looks like right there. This was only $12.90. I'm wearing it now. I got all of my sports bras in a size medium, which I'm a little concerned about because this one has a lot of under boob. Like it's not fitting all of my chest in there. It's pretty tight, but it doesn't cover me all the way. So I probably won't be keeping this one just because I'll never really wear it. I'll probably honestly fall out if I was running or something. Okay, so this is the next outfit. And I was a little nervous about these pants, but they actually look really cute and they hit in a really nice area. Now I did get these in a medium as well. I could have definitely gone with a small. I feel like I have a lot of room in the waist that I need them to be a little bit tighter. So if I'm running or something, I don't have to constantly pull them up. But the pattern is so cute. I wasn't sure how I would feel about it, but I really, really like it. I think it's so adorable. I also got the matching sports bra, which right there such a cute combo I'm not the type to wear a sports bra and leggings to the gym I'm just not there yet <laughs> but the sports bra for this one is so nice we are 36d it's gonna fit you just fine it's gonna hold everything in and it's tight enough to where if you ran it's still gonna support you but I wouldn't do super intense cardio you know what I'm saying because then might hurt a little bit. Whenever I do cardio, I wear a size small in sports bras to really push up against my chest, and that way they literally don't move. This is holding them pretty tightly, which I like. And then this shirt I think is cute. It's just like a little simple basic top. I like to tie tops like this a lot of the time, like in a little knot, just to add some shape. It doesn't really have much shape at all. It's kind of boxy, but if you're like me and don't really care and just want to throw something cute on, this is the way to go. I worry more about like leggings and how they look than I do my tops. And I need to see if they're squat proof. And I think they are squat proof, but in like this one area where there's a patch of gray, you can see a little bit of skin, but it's not like full blown butt vagina, okay? You know if you've been doing squats and you have the wrong pair of leggings on, it's a show and it's embarrassing. So it's always important to make sure they're squat proof. And I'm really surprised that the first two that I've tried are because they're so affordable. Okay, so this is the next little outfit. I love the cutout like mesh detail here. I think it's so sexy. These I got in a size small and these are definitely the right size for me. Again, these are high-waisted, which I love. I love high-waisted leggings, denim, everything. Um, and yeah, I just feel like they look so cute. They kind of flatten the booty out a little bit, but I'm okay with it. And they really hit right there on the tops of my hip bones, so it feels like they're going to stay there pretty well. And these leggings were $19.90, not bad at all. This top is the same top as that burgundy top. I love this one, the mesh detail. This is just a great, like, staple, basic top. Oh, it is. I see nothing in there. This is good. 
Next up we have these leggings right here. I really like the fabric of this and I like how the band fits as well. There's not like a super hard thread or whatever goes through the top of some high waist leggings that like really pulls in tight. It just kind of feels very comfortable, kind of feels like loungewear. And it's actually really flattering here at the top because it doesn't like cut off any tummy fat or anything like that. The only thing about these is that these will give you a camel toe, okay? They will give you hella camel toe. So just be warned. Um, I think I'm going to return them just for that reason. <laughs> but otherwise, they're really, really cute. Yeah. These are definitely squat proof. So I like them, but they give camel toe. I just can't work with it. Next up, we have these leggings. These, are, I think, are probably the most high-waisted ones that I bought. And I didn't know they were this high-waisted. Like, this is way above my belly button. This is just, like, super, super high. The kind of thing you can wear with a sports bra, and you would be fine. Um, I don't know if I would wear these to the gym, though, just because of this little detail right here. It's, like, super, super sexy. Just me, though. I probably wouldn't wear them, um, but they are really cute. I just feel like there's a lot of fabric here in the crotch area. I don't know why that is. Like, look at how long it is. It's just so long. So I am going to return these just because I'm not a fan of all that fabric, but I do think they're cute. Maybe if you had, like, a longer torso or something, you could get away with wearing these. Um, but, yeah, not my favorite. I have a feeling these aren't squat proof. Yeah. Those are not squat proof. That was like full on booty, okay? Full on booty. So, would not recommend these for the gym. Probably just wear them um, around the house or something, but don't squat in them because it shows everything. Okay, so since these are so high waisted, I figured I would show you guys this sports bra. And this one's really cute. It actually feels really comfortable as well. It has like a nice little back detail. I like this a lot. It is definitely not a high impact sports bra. It's definitely more of like low impact, like yoga, or if you wanted to do arms one day, not a lot of cardio, I would definitely go for this one. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna keep this. I also really like these leggings as well. These are, again, super high-waisted. I didn't think they, they would be this high-waisted, but I do really like it. I think they're adorable. You can wear like a little crop top with this. Yeah, I will say is I thought the ends of these were white, and they're definitely like a light pink, so I don't know if that bothers you or not, but they are. I'm also going to go ahead and throw on this little top that has mesh details all on the sleeve. It's just a little white basic top. So this is the top. I remember seeing a review on this one saying it was super boxy, and it is, but it also has like these cut details right here. So you could easily like knot it in the front or something. And with how high-waisted these leggings are, I mean, it looks completely fine with this. I don't know about y'all, but especially on leg days, I like to see at least from here down when I'm working out. That's why I like to tie a lot of tops up because I like to see all my muscles working. I don't know. I get a lot of satisfaction out of that. I actually really like the top and I think it's adorable. So let's see if these are squat proof. And they are. Well, no, they're not. No, they're not. These are not squat proof. You can definitely see my booty through them. So again, not something you would want for leg days, but you could use it for any other light training days. These definitely aren't as see-through as those all black ones that I showed you guys, like the see-through going all the way up to your hip bones but they are still a little bit see-through and something I wouldn't recommend squatting in. Hey guys, this is the next outfit. I love this one, mainly because I love the green leggings and this top is super cool as well. I wonder how these are gonna react. I guess you wouldn't dry these in the dryer because I feel like these letters would get all messed up. They're like this cool, shiny material. If you can see and it says bad habits. I don't know, I really think this is adorable. I love the color combo. I love the length of this top. It also has the cutouts on the side, which is really nice. And these leggings, again, I do love, but I definitely need a size small because they are pretty big on me. Again, you could always tie this up in the front since you have that cut detail. And this will also cover your butt. So if you have any butt sweat that happens, this covers it. So I like this a lot. I love the leggings. Definitely need them in a size small. Let's see if they're squat proof yep definitely squat proof so highly recommend these I feel like these would show a lot of sweat though 
so just be warned. These leggings I was really excited to get just because I thought they were super cute and something I would definitely wear to the gym. They have that little mesh detail right here, but they don't go all the way up. I love this color as well. I love like gray leggings. I think they're so fun. And this has that really nice high-waisted band again where it just lays perfectly on top. And it actually sits right there above your hip bones, which I love. Just like, it just sits there. It's perfect. Yep. Definitely are. So these are a keeper. I would definitely wear these on leg day. I just think they're so cute. These are the last pair of like all black leggings that I purchased because I have a lot of black leggings from Lululemon so I didn't want to buy too many. But I love these. These are my favorite that I've tried on for the all black. You have this little detail here on your calves. Nothing too extra, it just adds a little something to it. These are pretty high waisted. They go a little bit above my belly button which I love, those are my favorite. I did get these on a small and I just realized that I didn't mention a few other sizes. So I should have all the sizes listed in this video as well as the prices. So if I missed it, they should pop up on the screen for you. Uh, they're definitely a little bit see-through, not as much as the other one, but not enough to where I wouldn't wear them. Like I would wear these for any other day but leg day because I think they fit really well and they just feel really snug. So I like these, I'm gonna keep them. Okay, so these leggings I am definitely surprised by. They're a different material than I thought they would be, but they feel so good. I thought they were gonna be like, how, how do you say? Kinda like Spanx in a way, and they're not. They kinda feel like the gray ones where they just feel, I don't know, they feel comfortable. They're a lot more high rise than I expected. They are above my belly button, which I love. I also love the detail of these. They're so cute. I do have these in a medium. I could definitely go down to a small because it is a little bit big, but I like them. I like this little run detail right here. I think all of the shadows and stuff are really flattering. Oh yeah. Oh, no. You can see your booty. So these are, again, a little bit see-through. I might just keep them and then wear them with a longer shirt like this. So that way, you can't see my butt, you know? So these are the same as those black ones that I showed you that were like the see-through up to your like hip bones. They're super high-waisted. I actually like these more than the black ones just because they don't look so scandalous. Like I guess because they're this gray color, you can't really tell like I have a lot of skin here. <laughs> so I do really like them. I love the color. There's also a little bit of see-through mesh right here, which I think is so cute, or I guess like you'd call it netted. These are super high-rise. They go well above my belly button, and I actually really like these. I like the tie top with it as well because I just, I think all of this gray, black, and white kind of mixed in is just super flattering. So I love it. I got these in a size small. They fit perfectly. And I'm gonna take a wild guess and say these aren't splat proof, but we'll just do it. We'll try it for the tube. Oh, these are not bad. I actually don't see like anything at all. These are good to go, so I like them a lot. These are definitely a must have. I'm gonna be keeping these. I think they're so cute. Way better than the black ones, so if you don't wanna show your goodies, but you still want that kind of sexy open part right here, I would definitely go for these. Okay, so this is the last pair of leggings I'll be trying on. And these are super cute. They have like these cutout details right here, which I really like. Again, they're high-waisted. Very cute leggings. I got them in a medium. Again, I need a small. They are a little too big. They won't like sit next to me really tight, but I really like them. I'm gonna reorder these in a different size just because I love this little cutout. They're that perfect little size for capris. I love them. I guess I just have a thing for gray leggings. I think I do. Um, but yeah, so I like these a lot. Let's test out the squat ability. Oh yeah, these are fine. These are good. So these are definitely not see-through. These would be squat approved. Definitely need another size in these because I think they're so cute. Okay guys, so that is it for this try-on clothing haul from Forever 21. Overall, I'm pretty impressed by the quality. I did not have that high of hopes, but I feel like there was a lot of cute items, a lot of cute tops, leggings. Of course with the leggings, it's just gonna be you know trying them on, doing the squat test and making sure you're not showing any goodies when you're working out. All in all, I think it was about half and half. Some things I have to return, mainly because sizing, and then a lot of things I'm keeping. Let me know y'all's thoughts down below in the comments. Have you tried a lot of Forever 21 activewear? If not, 
let me know if you're going to. I'm a big Lululemon legging kind of person, but I'm definitely down to try affordable leggings if they work, and these are awesome, and I can't wait to get my other sizes. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave, and I will see you guys in my next video.